Quite a common mistake that I'll see people make with their Squarespace website is they forget to put the correct form email address, or they forget to put the correct email address into their form. So a lot of uh, a lot of times designers will do this. So if you hire a designer to do your Squarespace website, they will set up the contact form, set up all the different forms on the site. And then what they forget to do is put your email into those forms. So any submissions, when people try and get in touch with you, they'll go through to the designer and sometimes they'll see this, sometimes they won't, but it will take a while for them to you know, realize and rectify the decision. So to get ahead of that, if you've used a designer or if you've set up the site with your personal email, but you want submissions to go to your um, professional email, then this video is gonna teach you very quickly how to do it. Alrighty, so we're on the Buy Crawford website here, as we usually are. Now, what I wanna do is show you an example. So I have, I believe, a contact form somewhere on this page, so here. And it's usually, it should be, sam at bycrawford.com. So if I double click on my form, and then I go to storage, you can see email notification here. If I click on this, you can see this is the email that it's connected to. So this is the email that any form submission through that form is going to go to. Before anyone asks, unfortunately, as of yet, you can't have a, a contact form go to multiple recipients. It can only go through one email. So that's something to think about. What email do you want it to go to? And you can change that in here. So this will default to whoever created the form. So whatever email is associated with the account that created the form, it will automatically go here. So it is worth always double checking where this is. Once you put it in, so let's, you know, say, uh, sign up by crawford.com and you're happy, simply just click out, save and exit, and it's done. Really, really simple, but definitely, definitely worth checking out on your website or if you're building for other people on your client's website as well. Hopefully that helped. If it did, please make sure to leave a like and hit subscribe. And if you want me to build your Squarespace website, you can get in touch using the links in the description.